in the modern day and age of social media the all in one social media app socialites integrates all social media apps into one app focusing on security and simplicity which replaces a large amount of app data giving you the benefit of an ad blocker within it making social media simpler and better tapping on the app will lead you to the pattern lock only accessible by your desired pattern lock stored in cache likewise tapping on the google icon available within itself will lead you to the google web page opening via web view where you can browse through your curiosities all in the same app or facebook even the largest social media app within the world which you can scroll through your friends other activities in the same app or youtube all with a single login securely using the least of resources beginner to pro is a blog whose front end is developed using apache server and the codes are written in javascript css html w3 css bootstrap and php there are three modules beginner to pro aptitude and code to pro beginner to pro has educative videos and information about different topics which are hot and happening like android arduino and iot admin has the discretion of editing the contents which are posted by the user code to pro is an online integrated development environment which has the facility to code in java c c++ python etc on a single platform we can take input compile run or execute and see the output on a single page with the same name of the class aptitude is a module designed to improve mathematical skills from basic to advanced level online tests formula sets solutions to a large number of problems under each topic are available users can access a large set of formulas based on a single chapter and appear for tests on the same chloe assistant is a google chrome extension when user says open facebook the page opens on commanding to mail a new mail is composed when asked for location it opens the google map and does other similar works this is a robotic arm which is based on arduino here arduino nano is used with breadboard and four servos robot arm will move according to the values entered in the serial terminal the movement of the arm can be programmed as per the position of the object to make it work as a stand alone automated device This is human resource information system. It is used to develop staff easy access record platform. Giving the credential we can log into the respective modules. Using SHA256 algorithm login is authenticated. This is staff management module and these are sub of its some module. Here the staff can update their personal details. Even they can update their educational details. They can also update their specialization or subject taught. they can update their working experience in the previous universities they can also add extra curricular activities they can also add the academic activities and along with the other activities now here comes the report staff details where the staff can generate their report by selecting these fields now we can see after pressing search option the report is generated here we can even add the workload that is schedule their working period by clicking the submit button they can schedule the working period here comes the leave management module consisting some sub module where the staff leave details are managed along with the leave application see we can see the leave application leave authority application status and leave verify and this is publication module also consisting this sub module to maintain the publication details and it also generate the reports this is an obstacle avoiding robot It has an ultrasonic sensor which scans for distance in all directions using the servo motor. The brain of this robot is the Arduino Nano where all the logic lies. If an obstacle is detected before 20 cm, the robot stops and scans for direction and takes turns using the motor driver which basically is provides bidirectional current to both of the motors for movement. Mammography image corpus is an interface designed for the radiologists and researchers radiologists enter their credentials to access the case list by clicking on case 1 the mammograms are visible each case consists of four mammograms the right bar consists of the patient's detail 
and the case list. The radiologists can easily navigate to other cases using the case list. These images can be enlarged and annotations can be added on them. These annotations can be later extracted from the database and used to run under some machine learning technique for medical research. The project is home automation using speech recognition, which controls all household electrical appliances using voice commands like turn on light 1, turn on light 2, turn off light 1, turn off light 2. Two major challenges the world today faces are big data and fast data. Hadoop is a product that solves both of these problems. In HDFS, we have distributed storage. In MapReduce, we have distributed computing. HDFS is based on the concept of one master and many slaves. Basically, all these slave systems are connected to one master system which will increase the storage and capacity of this system. This application is developed to implement the whole big data Hadoop infrastructure at one click. Firstly, the master system is configured in such a way that it will virtually take storage from its slave system and appear to client as if it has sufficient memory to store big files. Master will slice off the file into small strips of data and distribute it among the slaves according to their capacity. Master will itself store the metadata of the slaves. Initially, the master system's capacity is 0 KB. Now, after connecting two slaves to it, the system's capacity will be increased. Hence, now the storage is 29.99 GB. Emotion recognition uses the change in various elements of your face to determine the emotion being exhibited. On a live web camera, it recognizes your face and matches it with an intelligently designed algorithm that classifies and compares your face to six natural emotions. The method can be extended to be utilized on static images to exhibit complicated human emotions like surprise or used on huge colorless transparent images to detect emotions like happiness. The program has been scaled to be utilized on various low lighting and high light conditions and tested on different image formats to detect emotions on images for example anger. Dune Diabetes is a research project of Soai University to monitor the blood glucose levels of the patient. Putting all the credentials on the login screen, user can use various features. Features consist of clinical profile, current treatment, blood glucose, diet, addiction, sleep, and stress. Inside the diet category, patient can add daily water intake. On clicking the add button to add one glass of water and food he or she has consumed. Likewise, we can use other options breakfast, lunch, snacks, dinner and additional food. Smart Home is an automated home consisting of IoT devices. Through an Android app blink we show how to control lights of two rooms. Using this panel, tapping on the first button, the lights turn on. Now, tapping on the same button, the lights turned off. Similarly, using other buttons, we can control other appliances of the home through internet. PIR motion detectors are also installed for intruder alert that let you receive an email alert notification through Carriot's cloud platform. Odyssey Music is a platform where you can enjoy the charm of old traditional Odyssey music. There are no such promising sites till date to highlight the importance of Odyssey music. There are many different modules and features in this site. We have provided keynotes to highlight the main point. So come and explore the old tradition of Odisha. Here we have implemented a line follower bot using PID control algorithm. In this algorithm, error is compensated using a closed loop feedback system. It compares the present output with the set point values and reduces the error.